UCLA, a five-game winning streak, moves to seven and four in conference, beating Colorado in Boulder, 64 to 60. The Buffs won the first quarter, 20 to 11, and then UCLA found their way, and they were led by their sophomore, Michaela Onionware, her ninth double-double of the season, her 10th game this year with over 20 points. She had 22 points, 11 boards. Her usual Onionware just getting it done and shot well from the field. Nine for 18, went 50%, one for two from the three, 50% from the free throw line as well with those 11 boards. And she just came up big, solid and steady player for them. Their leader is having a tremendous sophomore campaign for them finds a way to get it done. We know she's always going to be hitting the offensive board. I asked her where she gets that motor from, and she just said, whatever it takes for my team, I'm going to do it. For Colorado, last year as a junior, Alexis Robinson set her career high with 31 points against UCLA. Tonight, she reset that, 33 tonight against UCLA. Some players just like playing certain teams or the matchups, and for Robinson, it's definitely UCLA. And just knocked it down from deep, really showed us that range. I didn't realize she had it from that deep. And Great job getting to the free throw line. She stepped up big with Kennedy Leonard out, went 10 for 12 from the strike. The senior putting in great effort down the stretch of her Buffs career. Robinson scores 33 of the team's 60 points. UCLA, as they will do, they win that rebound battle by a dozen. They usually do, and then points in the paint are a big one. And field goal percentage for Colorado, just 29%. Free throw line luckily saved them for most of the game, but shooting under 30%, it's tough to win a lot of basketball games. UCLA has now out-rebounded their opponents in 21 of 23 games. The Bruins, five wins in a row, and they'll head to Utah next. UCLA by four over Colorado.